welcome back to another vlog so in today's video i just want to show you some things i got from home goods if you guys follow me for a while i'm taking my time to gradually invest in pieces for my forever home or my future apartment who knows i don't really want to go to the store and just get you know crazy just buying things and eventually just posting on Facebook Marketplace because I don't want them anymore. So I'm taking my time to really love these pieces and eventually invest in them. So right now I'm cooking. Let me show you guys what I'm cooking. And then I'm going to show you what I got from Home Goods. So this is the chicken I'm cooking. It smells so good. I just added a few spices and also green pepper and all pretty much the vegetables because we love that and I'm gonna use this gluten-free pasta unfortunately I'm using a lot of gluten-free products because I have a hard time um, I don't know what's going on I still have to go to the doctor but if it's not gluten-free my stomach hurts so bad and I get really sick so this is the chicken and let me show you what I got from Home Goods. Alright, so another thing I got from Home Goods is these beautiful mugs right here. They gave me this camper vibe that like I actually love. And this was only $3.99 and I got two of them. I was with my boyfriend at the store and I was like, do you want another one? Do you want the same mug like me? And he looked at me like, sure, why not? <laughs> so I love how it blends with my home decor. It just goes so perfect. You guys know I'm obsessed with ivory colors, this kind of like creams and stuff like that so they are super super cute i think camera they look kind of gray but it's not a gray color it's more like this beautiful cream and it's so so beautiful so i got two of them and also i got this hand soap i still have the other one i got since i moved in and they last long because you don't need too much and these things are amazing um i was looking up on amazon and online and they are so pricey they're over 30 dollars and 40 dollars and i don't know why it's so expensive so i like to get these every time i go to marshall's or home goods because it's only five dollars also it's like a cream so you're definitely gonna get that moisture every time you wash your hands and can we talk about you know the packaging it's so aesthetically pleasing my bed is not done so i apologize but i really want to show you guys this mirror right here is from home goods and it's so heavy like really really heavy and it was only 60 dollars and i'm planning to find another one for the other side of the bed so my boyfriend is in home goods right now just trying to find the other one hopefully because they have another one in different style which is a little bit more expensive like 80 dollars but i don't really like that style like it's not for me i want this one instead and it's so cute it's just so perfect like the gold is not too yellowish it's just more like a brass and the quality guys is legit like super super good i just love everything about it it's super super cute and right now i'm still in a home for a few lamps so it's just looking like this which is fine but I'm obsessed with this mirror. So hopefully I can find another one from the other side. I think it really gonna go as well. If not, I'm just gonna get two large mirrors in gold. And that will be the plan. So you guys, I got this panel divider or whatever you guys can call this thing from Facebook Marketplace. I still had the tag on it. It was literally in a box and it's this person like she just have I guess like a little business on Facebook. Like she just sell things like really new and it was only $50 and it works for me. I like the ivory color. It really blends with my home decor but it really works with the space. I hate the fact that it's kind of like blocking the bar car area but I have a dog and sometimes when I'm cooking or whatever I really want him to come to the kitchen area so that's the reason why I have this panel there and it works perfectly. Um, I like everything about it. It's pretty simple, but for $50, I was like, yes, because I was scrolling. And even on Facebook Marketplace, I found a few for $200. And I was like, no, I just need something that is going to basically separate the room so he don't have to come in here. But this was a steal. Also, I went to Dollar Tree and I got these candles from only $125. You guys know the prices went a little bit up on Dollar Tree, but it's still a deal for these beautiful candles. The color is perfect. It's this beautiful ivory that blends with my home decor. And let me show you guys, I have another pair. So far, I styled the other pair like this and it looks so cute. I love it. I don't think I ever gonna burn them here. 
um, because this candle holder is a little bit big. You guys can see it's kind of like dancing a little bit, but it's so cute. So you guys know I was in a home for a lamp and I came across to this one on Facebook Marketplace. If you guys can tell, it is completely new, the tag on, everything in good condition and it was only $30. And I haven't been able to check the price, but I believe this is originally for $100 um, Target. So for $30, this is such a steal. And I like how rustic and cute this is gonna go in my bedroom and i'm definitely gonna get another one for the other side of the bed all right y'all so my bed is not done so ignore that part but how beautiful the lamp look here it's so pretty in love totally um definitely i want another one for the other side right there but yes and the good thing about this is that you can manage the lighting. So if I want it like more warm, I can definitely do that. Beautiful. And also just can put all the way. And it's more brighter. I don't know what I thought it was $100 each. I think I was just looking for the recent ones she have. Uh, for this year but the original price is $50 which is not that bad so I got it for 30 bucks so I only had to pay 50 <laughs> for the next one so it's super cute it really elevates the space I love the vessel or whatever they call um, kind of rustic but so so beautiful so this is the buy right now and I'm loving it all right y'all so I'm just gonna go ahead and start Open these spots. I'm using my keys because I don't know where it's my scissors. But I'm literally like a kid right now. <laughs> oh, here it is. Oh my god. Oh, this is Christmas for me. Alright, so this is how it comes. Let me just Put the computer more away because it's definitely hitting the lighting different all right so here is how it comes it's so beautiful i mean so far i like how it feels um pretty heavy <laughs> um but here it is this is the gold one i wanted a silver one but I thought it was about to be silver, but apparently it's white. I don't know why they did it that way. Um, so because I wasn't sure if it was silver, I just decided to go the. I just decided to get the gold, but I think goes well with my home decor, my style, all that aesthetic stuff. So I'm just gonna go ahead and open it. Oh my god. This is beautiful. I know on camera looks white, but it's a pretty gold. I don't even know how to describe it. It's just, I would say almost like an ivory. And I know you guys know I'm obsessed with ivory colors right now with my home decor, but you guys can see that. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and open it. This is absolutely beautiful. Look at that. It's a beautiful gold. It's just perfect. I'm not regretting it. I thought I wanted the silver one, which apparently is white, but this is perfect. Beautiful. <laughs> I ordered from Amazon a case and also a charger because unfortunately the last iPhones they don't come with that they only come with the core but you also had to purchase the adapter or whatever they call so that's on the way luckily my boyfriend have an iPhone so I'm gonna be able to 
use him but it's so beautiful i'm obsessed i'm just gonna go ahead and play a little bit and see how i feel with the phone um it's a beautiful size it's literally perfect um i believe the iphone 13 is way more smaller but this one is just perfect i'm totally in love with this so um i'm gonna see and we go from there yeah